Hi everybody, Chris here from Truly Holistic. Now this is a video uh, about the Divine Feminine. Uh, it's talking about uh, the reproductive system and menstruation and menopause and everything uh, in regards to that. Now, one thing I do want to talk about uh, with menstruation, you know, if you're having heavy, heavy periods, uh, excessive bleeding, uh, one thing that we need to know is that the body is very smart in the way that it detoxifies itself or it tries to survive, okay? And one detoxification method that uh, women go through, obviously men don't go through, uh, and it's actually been linked to why women perhaps live longer than men, is the menstruation cycle, okay? And when you have your menstruation cycle, it's the body trying to cleanse itself to get ready to intubate a child, right? Or create a human being. And so, for example, for women out there that have having really heavy bleeding and having problems in, in that topic is because if you've got a, a, a heavier flow, that usually means you have more buildup of toxicity in the body because the body's trying to purge it out through that detoxification method of the menstruation. Okay, so that's one thing you need to take into account, that maybe I should be looking at my diet, maybe should be looking at what I'm, what food I'm eating, what I'm drinking. Also looking at our thought processes, the people we're, we're spending time around, that it could be a reflection on your relationship as well. Um, it could be a number of things, but it all comes down to toxicity. So that's that's number one. Now, in regards to, let's look at, you know, middle-aged women in regards to menopause. And this is not necessarily middle-aged woman. This could be happening in your 30s or even earlier. You know, we're a woman having problems uh, with their reproductive system in their 20s where, you know, the, they've tried, they feel like they've tried everything and they're, they're going to a gynecologist asking to remove everything out, okay? Or uh, their reproductive system, their ovaries, their uterus and so on getting a hysterectomy. Now, one thing about the reproductive system is um, not all the uh, diagnostic tests are going to show that, uh, that there's a problem, okay? And this can be specifically linked to hormonal imbalance, okay? The hormones are the major switches of, of not only your sexual organs, so uh, for uh, your... Uh, for your reproductive system, but for everything, you know, and what we see with people, women that have this problem in regards to whether it's heavy bleeding or endometriosis or uh, polycystic ovaries, a number of conditions in regards to the reproductive system is there is a problem also with emotions, keeping emotions in check, also mood um, and a number of things because it's all hormonally related, right? So one thing um, we do here at True Holistic is we do look at the hormonal uh, balance, okay? And we look at that everything needs to be in check. So for example, the woman, um, the, the balance, the thing that keeps estrogens in check is progesterone, okay? And what we find with especially women when they're going through menopause is that is there is becoming the hormones are becoming imbalanced and estrogen is not getting challenged by progesterone. And not necessarily always like this, but majority of times it is. And progesterone gets the name from progestation. Okay, obviously gestation, the period of holding on to a baby, getting pregnant, holding on to a baby. So it kind of gets to a time where uh, the body's been programmed to all of a sudden shut down. Okay, we're not going to be making children anymore. Now, I guess the big question we ask there is, that, well, why is that that way? Okay? One thing here at Truly Holistic, and, uh, and one thing I've really looked at uh, uh, for a while now, is understanding reality. Okay? And what I've come to find about reality is reality, all realities are programmed. Okay? And <clears throat> if a reality is programmed then there is programming in place, or we can look at it like the analogy of a computer. There's software in place for your body to work in a certain way. And if we look at your reproductive system, obviously it's programmed to work in a certain way to a certain age, and then for everything 
to just close down, which we call menopause, right, for a woman. It happens to a lesser degree in men, which we call andropause. <clears throat> so what we do here at Truly Holistic, we look at it in that way. We look at the programs of why the, why the reproductive system <laughs> reproductive systems programmed in a certain way and if there's something that's programmed in a way for you to go th- to shut down and for your energy to cease okay not to continually evolve okay and what that means is if your energy in a certain part of your body is evolving it can replenish itself it can regenerate if the energy is uh, obstructed or occluded or ceased it no longer evolves and therefore that area will just degenerate and really what we're seeing with a reproductive system in regards to menopause is your reproductive system degenerating okay because certain hormones that are needed there to keep everything in check and everything to work including not only uh, a, a, a chance for you to um, uh, get pregnant um, but you know, your mood to be stabilized, uh, to to not have pain, uh, to not have growths and all these like um, uh, cysts and stuff occur within your reproductive system. It causes so many other problems. You know, progesterone will keep the estrogens in check. Everything stays balanced, okay? So we look at that, and if you need a certain area that needs more progesterone, then we will program your body at an energetic level, on a very deep level, to do that, okay? And uh, if there's other problems like cysts and stuff already in there, we can then address that, and we can remove those things too. We can, when going back to the earlier topic in regards to your a heavy uh, menstruation um, and, 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 and heavy flow is... Okay, we ask the questions, well, what are the toxins that are building up in the body that's creating that to occur? So lo and behold, we find the toxin, whether that's mercury or heavy metal or preservatives that are in food or coming from your lifestyle. Could be something even more far field than that. We remove that. We remove the causes why these heavy flow. Okay, we don't just blame, think that, well, what's wrong with my reproductive system why is the you know the heavy flow we look at the reasons why we remove the cause okay not the symptoms not the symptoms the cause of what you why you've got heavy flow why you've got endometriosis what what's going on with the lining of your um uh the endothelial lining of your uterus what what's going on there we look at it at a very deep level we look at going to the ovaries and we go well, why you know what's happening in the fallopian tube why uh, what's happening in regards to the hormones. We look at everything. We look at it from an emotional standpoint. We look at the hormones. We look at toxicity in the body. It could be uh, reoccurring yeast infections in that area causing a problem. It could be can, uh, like a fresh type of problem, a yeast, mold. It could be a number of things. And we look at everything and anything that could be causing a problem there. So if you're someone that has issues whether that's you know, endometriosis, whether you have polycystic ovary syndrome, whether you have um, heavy flows and, and bleeding problems, whether you are going, uh, having a really tough time going through menopause, okay, in regards to you know, uh, hot flashes and um, you know, heavy mood swings where you cannot control it and you become, your personality changes and people around you suffer because of it and you don't like that because of course you're suffering inside. You don't want other people to feel that way around you. If you have any of those problems, go ahead and book an appointment at trulyholistic.net and we can really, really help you. Okay, and we can balance these things out and get your body working correctly and in balance. And that's why we call ourselves Truly Holistic, because we look at it at a very holistic nature. And if you've been to a number of other health prof- pro- uh, professionals and things just do not make sense to you in regards to why it's like that, and there's something inside you that's trying to tell you otherwise, I'm here to listen to you and I'm here to help you with your problems. So go ahead and book some appointments, or book an appointment at trulyholistic.net. If you have any queries, you can get in touch with me through my website or leave a question below.